Japan has been struggling to revamp its once world-famous tech industry. Analysts say a risk-averse culture is holding back investments in new companies. Now, Japan's second largest city, Osaka, has particularly struggled in Tokyo's shadow. But a new startup scene there is promising to boost the industry. TRT World's Sandra Gatman has this report from Osaka. Osaka is better known as Japan's foodie capital than a buzzing business hub. But the city is on a mission to nurture its startup scene. The answer, some think, to Japan's ailing economy, weighed down by an aging population. Japan has always been synonymous with innovation. But a lot of that technology and creativity has been stifled, especially here in Osaka, where entrepreneurs complain they don't get support or funding from the government, let alone from private investors who tend to shy away from risky startups. But nestled inside one of Osaka's newest shopping malls is Japan's first so-called idea lab where shoppers stop by and try on new products for size. With traditional product studies, customers don't get to see what's being made until something's final. But here, the general public provide feedback to us, becoming part of the process and part of the startup community. Not everything on display is designed for sale. Inspiring excitement and curiosity for new technology is a goal in itself. I'm interested in new technology, so I thought it would be fun to come and see it for myself. It seems they're making more and more convenient products, and I hope that helps Japan progress. Startups in Osaka make up just 8% of businesses, but produce 40% of new jobs. Japan overall still has three times fewer startups per capita than the U.S. One reason is a lack of venture capital. Investment in Japan is roughly $1.2 billion compared to the $75 billion on offer in the U.S. Japan's world-famous car makers used to be the go-to employers for university graduates. Students are now being encouraged to launch startups early, like this university team who built this new electric car. Other developers have bigger ambitions. This mobile phone app uses a QR code to translate packaging and offer recipes. It's their way of putting Japanese products on the world market and Osaka on the tech map. Sandra Gatman, TRT World, Osaka.